what's happening i tell you exactly what's happening hello youtube hello facebook hope you're all doing good it's another week it's another video it's another bunch of stock that i'm listing on my ebay store literally i've just taken pictures of absolutely everything so i'm going to start my long long time of getting all this stuff on the ebay store um things are absolutely crazy at the minute on there things are selling really really well all over the world which is incredible don't forget combined postage on everything and selections and something for every single budget that's all i'm gonna say so i'm gonna start you in this corner as i always do lovely bandai jag that's not too bad at all is it and of course you got the the little barking dog one love that of course they do this in a bigger version as well which i do actually have which i might bring out sometime but that is just easy for display and of course you can pull him in as well if you don't want him going out the window when you're driving which is quite cool actually got some mint mcconnell motors etc with paperwork literally fully fully complete this is nice isn't it it's an arnold absolutely stunning look at that love it of course not often seen so much in pink either you always see the police cars the ambulances the blue version but you never see it in pink well i don't anyway to be honest with you chud valley weekend clockwork with the little milk floats lovely mercedes just check that out friction drive plastic scream 70s really doesn't it late 60s early 70s that's lovely do apologize that's my phone dinging away this this is stunning absolutely stunning original tracks fully working as well even looking at the artwork on the box i love it that's absolutely stunning then you've got the lincoln international racing go-kart again fully working literally the way you dress reminds me of um fred of scooby-doo but that's just me and you've got this little dancing guy as well you wind him up switch him on and he just dances away he needs to be wound up but you get it original box as well with it which is quite cool and we've got this look at this ambulance i've got an elastic band on it just to keep the doors closed they do they are fully attached on it with the stretchers in there so you know i've just done it like that just to keep it there also met toys off the top of my head as well isn't it lovely absolute x shop stock beetle mint fully working mint just check that honestly you won't believe how clean this thing is literally as new then we've got the Mustang as well, the Stunt Mac 1 Mustang. So I'm placing that late 60s, I'm guessing, something like that, early 70s. Literally, goes around on that, and then see that little bar there? When it gets to point, it just comes out, flips the car onto its side, which is quite cool. Then we've got some Pen and Puppets, Thunderbirds, you know, Jerry Hans and stuff always sells really well. You know, they're not the original 70s ones, these are 1992 off the top of my head, but you know, 50, 60 quid each, sell all day long. And they're absolutely new, brand new with paperwork, never been used. The burger chef as well. He's fully working, although he's got an egg in there, not a burger. But, you know, I suppose my man can make some eggs for you. That's quite cool. Got a lovely robot here as well. The robot's always been selling well recently. He is lovely. I do like that. And we've got a lovely crane truck, fully operational. You know, winch on the one side, you can drop the bucket on the back levers as well. Whichever one they are, the top of my head without me looking. You know what I'm saying? You can raise that, change all that. That's awesome. That's cool. CQ, loads of CQ on the store. Always sells really, really well. Matchbox polo truck, stunning. The Rover as well, mint in the box. This is part of the X Shop stock stuff I bought about six, seven years ago. Never been used. There was a load of it as well. Absolutely mint. But the outer boxes were damaged, so I just thought, you know what? Sell as a loose model, sell on there. It is what it is. That's one of them that came out of the stuff. Box was damaged when I bought it. But the car itself is just as it left the factory. Even got the little plastic clip in the back to hold the trunk open. Then I've got loads of original figures, as you know. All you can see going on, but there's a bit of Kojak, a bit of professionals, a bit of Starsky and Hutch. You know, again, sorry, phone dinging. That's literally doesn't stop between ebay and messages coming through all the time you know how much is this how much is that it literally doesn't stop but that's a good thing i'm not complaining about it got some britons with paperwork lovely little triangle bus look at that look at the artwork on her as well i love the old livery on them oh nearly went i nearly went i'll be honest with you it's recorded that's fine late 50s bed for ambulance that's nice when the windows just started coming in so that's why about 58 59 something like that we've got a little um simca dinky as well that's quite nice though isn't it you know over coming weeks i will bring some more box stuff out as well i know i haven't done it recently but to be honest with you right coming from a business standpoint all this tin plate battery operated stuff has been selling like that literally like that so it makes sense just for me to the majority of the stuff to bring out that 
So I'm, I'm enjoying it as well though. Dinky forklift, just recently sold one of these. Wasn't as even as good as this. That's absolutely mint complete with paperwork, with a little um, pallet, winder, everything on there. We've got ambulance, dinky as well. Absolutely mint in the box. Bit of wear on the box, but it's all there. Nice coloring, no sun fading. And then I've got, you know, just for this cheaper budget as well, you know, the little Trojan vans and a Dunlop, SO, Brookborn T. You know, that's a more nice one, I'm 25, 30 quid in that condition, easily, versus mint box. Add a hundred pound on that, if not more. This is from the shop stock stuff I bought as well. Absolutely brand new, never been out of the box. Not even a valuable model, but it's nice, you know, 15 quid. Now you got yourself something nice there from the late 70s. Lovely. These, this is where it gets special. Now these were bought from an ex shop stock as well. Um, literally, I had trade boxes and trade boxes and trade boxes of just dinky catalogs, corgi catalogs, matchbox, Britons, everything. And they are all absolutely pristine. So I do apologise a bit of reflection on them. I've put them in these plastic covers just to try and keep them a little bit safe. You know what I'm saying? Look at the artwork on that. It's worth it just to buy in. I know it's a bit of a crime, but I'd literally buy that and frame it, to be honest with you. A lot of Jerry Anderson ones. I've got a line up on there as well. I've also still got them in bulk. Brand new. Never used. They're in there to keep safe. There's 11 or 12 in each, in, um, each pack here. But they're there, ready to go. Morton's Marketplace. Like that's a shop where they were ish. Well, you know, they stamped them on there for the shop and then they never sold them. These are all in trade packs. So if you want catalogs, going on to the eBay store, these are going to be the best condition you will find because there's no edges worn. The pages are crisp. The colours are vibrant. They are absolutely incredible. There, look at him. Clockwork. I've put elastic man just to keep the key safe on it. But um, yeah, he just walks along. And literally, there we go. I'll show you these quickly as well, because I'm still digging other boxes out as well. You know, gee, honestly, these James Bond things, right, have sold so quick. I've sold about 50 something in the last two weeks. You know, they're only 15, 20 quid each, but they've been flying out. So I brought some 164 Johnny Lightning's Corgis as well. Also, a bunch of Salido military models. You know, they're all in lovely condition, no boxes, but they are lovely. These are bought from a chap who had a massive military collection. Some stuff was boxed as well. And other bits were just, you know, mint but loose. So it is basically still as new. Little CIJ as well, light thing, that's cool. Some Britons in here. You know, again, something for everyone. So literally, just Google Jordan's Vintage World. If not, look down below, link in the description, which will take you through to my Vintage World. If you're on Instagram, just search for Jordan's Vintage World. It'll ping up Facebook, Jordan's Vintage World. It'll ping up. You can follow stuff on there because I don't film everything and I'm listing every single day. So last week you missed a load of mint box lesnies and match boxes are listed on the store. I didn't film a video, but if you were following any other social media sites, you would have seen them. So, you know, I'll put all that in the description below. If not, take care. Worldwide shipping available. I'm not asking you to buy. Go and have a little look. And if you can appreciate it as much as I can, awesome. So until next time, peace and love as per usual. See you next week with another toy video.